Hello, welcome to another video from Prep Easy's Medical Channel. This mnemonic relates to biochemistry, which will help you to remember the 20 amino acids very easily. It will also help you to remember 10 essential amino acids on your fingertips. In addition to your regular semester exams, this mnemonic is very helpful in pre medical entrance exams like MCAT, NEAT, and medical PG exams like USMLE, PLAB. AMC, NEAT, PG, etc. because it helps you to solve the multiple choice questions on amino acids in less than 30 seconds. Don't forget to click on the subscribe button and press the bell button to be the first one to know when we upload new videos. As you know, there are 20 amino acids, namely valine, isoleucine, proline, glycine, alanine, leucine, phenylalanine, tryptophan, tyrosine, histidine, arginine, lysine, glutamate, aspartate, cysteine, threonine, methionine, glutamine, asparagine, serine. And we all know how difficult it is to remember the different categories of these amino acids, which ones are hydrophobic or water-fearing, aliphatic or aromatic, which ones are hydrophilic or water-loving, basic or positively charged, acidic or negatively charged, neutral or uncharged. Further, which ones are polar or non-polar? Among them, some are alcoholic, amide or sulfur-containing amino acids. In this video, I'll teach you a very easy way to remember all these amino acids. In addition, I'll tell you mnemonics for remembering the 10 essential amino acids. So, let's get started. First, we will cover hydrophobic amino acids. They are water haters as they do not want to interact with water and they interact with themselves. So, this slide contains hydrophobic amino acids which are aliphatic. They are called aliphatic as they have alkyl side chains. And the mnemonic is phobia of vamp girl. Phobia will remind you that these are hydrophobic amino acids. VAMP stands for valine, alanine, methionine and proline. GIRL stands for glycine, isoleucine, R is no amino acid, L for leucine. I hope this VAMP in this picture is phobic. Well, moving on to hydrophobic amino acids which are aromatic that is having aromatic side chains the mnemonic is aroma of pine and timber trees aroma will remind you that these are aromatic amino acids p from pine stands for phenylalanine t from timber stands for tyrosine and t from trees stands for tryptophan so these were the hydrophobic amino acids. Now, point to remember is, all hydrophobic amino acids, that is the water haters, are non-polar, except tyrosine, which is polar. Actually, this is an exception and some also consider it as hydrophilic. Let's first take a look at hydrophilic amino acids, which are basic or positively charged. To remember these, amino acids just remember that last action hero movie of 1993 had a positive message positive will remind you that these are positively charged amino acids l from last stands for lysine a from action stands for arginine and h from hero stands for histidine now Let's move to hydrophilic amino acids which are negatively charged or acidic. These are glutamate and aspartate. To remember these, the mnemonic is glue contains acid, where G from glue stands for glutamate and A from acid stands for aspartate. Acid also reminds that these are acidic hydrophilic amino acids. Please note that these are the only amino acids that ends with 8-A-T-E. Now, as you know, the remaining five amino acids are the hydrophilic amino acids, which are uncharged. These amino acids are polar. These are 
cysteine, threonine, glutamine, asparagine, and serine. To remember these, please remember, come, take, gas. C from come stands for cysteine. T from take for threonine. And gas stands for glutamine, asparagine, and serine. See how easy it was to remember the 20 amino acid? I hope this proves to be useful in your studies. Moving forward, you guys know that there are two amino acids which are alcoholic, serine and threonine. To remember, here is the mnemonic. Alcohol tastes sour. Alcohol will remind you that these are alcoholic amino acids. And T from taste stands for threonine. S from sour stands for serine. Now moving on to amide amino acids. To remember these, you can use the same mnemonic which we used for acidic amino acids. That is glue contains acid. Where G from glue stands for glutamine and A from acid stands for asparagine. Only difference is that amide amino acids end with ion, I-N-E, instead of eight, A-T-E, as in the case of acidic amino acids, which were glutamate and aspartate. In addition, there are two amino acids which contain sulfur. So, sulfur containing amino acids are cysteine, methionine. To remember, here is the mnemonic, SCM, supply chain management, where S from supply refers to sulfur, C from chain refers to cysteine, and M from management refers to methionine. I'm sure you love these mnemonics. Just remember, all acidic and basic amino acids are charged amino acids. All hydrophobic amino acids are non-polar except tyrosine. All uncharged, neutral, hydrophilic and tyrosine are polar. Now, moving on to the last part of this video, that is remembering 10 essential amino acids, there are two good mnemonics for this. The first one is Private Tim Hall, where PVT stands for phenylalanine, valine and threonine. TIM stands for tryptophan, isoleucine, methionine. And HALL stands for histidine, arginine, leucine, lysine. Another mnemonic is, these 10 valuable amino acids have long preserved life in man. This statement also helps you to remember that these are valuable amino acids and hence essential amino acids. Here, first letter of each word stands for one of the 10 essential amino acids. These are the mnemonics in one slide. You can remember them starting from right hand side, from the middle and moving anti-clockwise as Phobia of Vamp Girl for Hydrophobic Aliphatic Then on top, Aroma of Pine and Timber Trees for Aromatic Last Action Hero for Positively Charged or Basic Hydrophilic Glue Contains Acid for Acidic Hydrophilic with Amino Acids ending in 8 Then come Take Gas for Neutral or Polar Hydrophilic Alcohol Taste Sour for Alcoholic Glue Contains Acids for amide ending in INE, SCM supply chain management so sulfur containing amino acids, private Tim Hall for essential amino acids. I hope you'll find these mnemonics very helpful in your studies and exam preparation. Please like and share with your friends. Do give your feedback by commenting below. Connect with us on Facebook and Twitter. Also, click on the link in the description below to take a quiz based on this mnemonic.